All right, everybody, this is my Cummins motor that I picked up, and I've put this inside an F-250. And so far, this is how much room you've got to pull this off. You can see how she fits in there. I've got the uh, motor mounted down. I've got the power steering line hooked up, brake booster hooked up. I've got a... Uh, the only thing I ain't got hooked up on the line wise, I ain't got the fuel lines hooked up and I need to put one more radiator hose on. And the way this is done, I've got to do it a little bit more engine ingenuity. I gotta run it. Cause the plumbing for it is over here on the motor. And spot I have to hook it up to the radiators all the way over there on the complete other side but I actually did get to start it up for just a split second but it didn't have enough fuel running to it because I ain't got the lines hooked up it literally started for just a second off what was still in the system so uh, but that's what it looks like um, it looks to me, it looks pretty close to factory. I don't know about y'all, but to me, it looks pretty well factory, so. And I think the truck will probably do a whole lot better once everything's hooked up, which shouldn't be too much longer. I'm, I'm hoping I can find those other parts before too much longer, so. Maybe with any luck, I can, but. Y'all tell me what y'all think of the way this looks in here so far.